All right. Randy in the Nissan. What is this, day four? Tomorrow is the day, tomorrow the hunt opens. So, last night we really broke down and looked at kind of on the computer, bigger screen, the rams we've been seeing and uh, confirmed that this first one that we found, the one that I had scouted out uh, before the season about a month ago, he's, uh, he's the best ram. And it's fun that I found him before and we found him again now. He took a little look and, and he's just, he's pretty. He's got everything he could want. So we uh, put him to bed last night. Now we're going to go find him again this morning and tomorrow's opening day. So let's try and keep an eye on him from a long distance today and relax, watch him and see what he does tonight so that we can know right where he's at in the morning. It's chilly. Yeah, but it's four degrees warmer than it was yesterday, right? What's the plan? So right up here, up this cut, kind of up towards the rim is where uh, Don and Scott put him to bed last night. He can't be too far. There's, pl there's plenty of pinion in there. He could have dropped down in, so. Let's get some elevation. Let's hike up here behind us. And uh, that's gonna take like five minutes to hike up there. It'll warm us up. <laughs> All right. All right, I actually have to tie my boots. Yeah. I have two other rigs parked over here. They came down and saw our rigs parked, and so they went, what, three quarter of a mile away? Ah, oh, we'll set up. We'll We'll see what they're looking at. <laughs> yeah. Well, now that I know that, I need to just go be the decoy at some bad location where there aren't going to be any sheep. Just run 60 miles an hour off the road and yeah. park and look. Stack all of my optics up, like point them all some direction. Big hand signals. Yeah. Act like I'm on a radio. Hey, hey. <laughs> huh? He's this big. Yeah. That's how you That's gotta your do decoy, it. Yeah. I know. And then they'll go and set up by you. I know. Say, what's he looking at? Yeah, I should run off the ridge here, make sure they see me, jump in my truck and just haul the freight down that way. Go burning up past them along the ridge. Yeah. Yeah. Well, let's see, how many guys we got? We got me and you, we got the two camera guys, we got Don, we got Scott, we got Chad, Sean, and Wesley. They're way down. They're like, what, 40 miles south of here? Right yeah, now? they're looking there until noon, and they'll come help make sure we bed this guy. Okay. But we got, we got, we got folks. Yeah. Well, the sun's been up now for a couple hours. Mm -hmm. It's warming up. Thankfully. Yeah. And uh, we haven't been able to find him. Mm -hmm. So we're all spread out here looking. There's some sheep, but just not that ram. Yeah. I think we're going to divide and conquer, so leave I'll you up here, okay. if you don't mind, with Don. Mm -hmm. You guys keep an eye on this face, and we'll go look in that backside. Okay. We'll go Let's find him. Big, big Hank. <laughs> yeah. Those big longhorn sheep. too well. You should pull out your spotter all the time. Sunday afternoon, we left Randy and Don and Scott over on the other side of this and we came and hiked up here where we could see this whole area and we just haven't been able to turn them up yet so we're looking at 
the maps and just really trying to figure out where exactly he is and we'll figure him out. Go grab lunch, put our heads together, see if those guys, maybe they've even picked him up since we've been here, but we've definitely been able to check this box. He's not in here. You don't have to work any harder. Yes. He's bedded over there. Is he really? Yeah, those guys are on him. Yes. Yeah, Don found him. Like hey, this? You guys had been gone maybe a half hour. And Don's like, man, I see a white butt way up there in the pinions. Sweet. Well, we watched him until about just before noon. And I said, I got to be back here to meet up with you guys. <laughs> <clears throat> and as I was walking away, Scott said, hey, they're up and moving and they're going towards that big cut. Okay. So, hmm. well, I think tonight, because of the way they're moving, they go in and out of these cuts and you lose them. Mm -hmm. So you got to move back and forth to find them. I think we stacked yeah. optics Okay. from where we were at further south. That way you can look into those angles. Sweet. Yeah, it's the same three. Awesome. Yeah, no doubt about it. All right, so lunchtime, those guys have had an eye on that ram. Um, he just went behind a bunch of topography that you can't see. So he's lost again, but we know his general area. I think we're the only guys in here that know where this ram is. The other guys know that it exists, but they haven't seen it for several days, and we've been watching it for several days, so. We came up here, had a great vantage point. Just couldn't turn them up. Lots of ewes, several young rams, but not that band of three. So hopefully they just fed over the top and those guys got a good look at them and were able to bed them because we don't have an eye on them. So we'll see what tomorrow morning brings and see what the word is at camp. What'd you see? Finding? We couldn't find them. See anything good? No. You guys? Hold it low. We found him. Sean put him to bed for you. <laughs> <laughs> you guys came up here and found him? Yeah, he's back over in here. Nice. <clears throat> That's him. Yep. He had his two little guys with him. Right there. Oh yeah, looking at you. Yeah, looking right at us. We were like, you could tell on that right side he had that a little bit thinner on than the left or whatever. And so, but they were right at the top in those trees. So it's Sunday. Yesterday afternoon, three good buddies joined us on the sheep hunt. We got Sean, his brother Wesley, and Chad. All good friends. We've done some hunts together, and they were uh, kind enough to come join me on my sheep hunt. Well, you guys got them penned up for tomorrow morning, I hope, right? Somewhere in so, the two-mile radius. Somewhere in the five-mile radius. <laughs> yeah, somewhere like that. That's what the I good think. thing is, we know where he's at, and nobody else does, right? And he's not somewhere that's going to He was really hard to see, to yeah, tonight, so I don't think anyone else was watching him, so shouldn't have too much competition. On well, him. I was watching you guys. Were you? Yeah. Were you up yeah. on the hill? Yeah. We were watching you, too. I know. I was like, <laughs> you're looking at me. <laughs> 